Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Bravely Default. Let's just go right where we left off. I think we're just about to go to the um, beauty pageant. So, I just saved. Let's go in. Next up, we have entrance number five. It's Mary! It and shine all over again. I nearly forgot to breathe. She'll do fine. And we're here just in case. The stage fright isn't the only thing worrying me. Last I heard, there were a total of six girls competing today. So why is Agnes's entry number nine? Where are the other three, you mean? Maybe they panicked at the last minute? Hmm. I suppose it's possible. <laughs> the lovely Mary. Next up, number nine. On yes. Oh, here she comes. Agnes? Agnes! Agnes! You're on! Go! Huh? Entrant number nine? It's still your turn! Come on down! Oh, right! Sorry! What was she thinking with that bland get-up? She's clearly delusional. I almost feel bad. Almost. <laughs> I didn't come all the way here for this. Boo! Boo! Chill out, bro. I say, watch out, bro. She's a monk, bro. She'll bot one, too. Give me that Chris Brown combo. Oh This may reach you. Though great distance has come between us, I consider you my friend, now as in childhood. You are a source of joy, a target of aspiration. You were ever one step ahead, but you would always stop to reach out a gentle hand to guide me. Just to see your smile and hear you speak filled my days with warmth. Yet now, I do not even know where you are. The smile you wore as a girl is still so fresh in my mind. And yet, I feel my breast will be torn asunder from worry. You could just say, hey, yo, Olivia, where you at? I want to see you just again. Same. To know that you are well. To be truthful, I am terrified without you. Even now, as a grown woman, I force myself onward, but any confidence I show is hollow deception. Every pause, every quiet moment, I feel ready to fall to my knees and wail as I did back then. Please. I feel I cannot withstand this crushing weight. I cannot manage it alone. I cannot imagine completing my task without you there. Without your aid. For so long, I'd swallowed back these doubts. Tried to be strong. But I fear old habits are not soon broken. I will wait for you. So please, if you are watching, tell me. 
Let me know you are there. Give me some small sign, and this time I will do as you once did. I will reach out my hand to you. I... Thank you very much. Fair enough. Can't be helped. Hers was an appeal wholly out of keeping with the contest's theme. Perhaps I ought to have worn the bikini after all. You were just fine. You said what you came to say. The idea was never to win the contest. If Olivia heard that, I'm certain your words will move her. I hope so. Hmm? I wonder what... a letter? Wait, is it from... Uh, Olivia! She wrote me a letter! See? You got through to her just fine! So, what does it say? Hey, we're being hunted I down! I heard about your appearance at the festival, though I was not able to attend. It puts my heart to ease knowing that you have also weathered this terrible crisis. I wish to meet with you as well, Agnes, my one true friend. But I fear I am not free to move about. Behind the ruins to the west lies the hidden village of the Crystal Orthodoxy. You will find me there. Do not allow this letter to be seen by any eyes but yours. Not even the matriarch can know. Awfully cautious, isn't she? If I trust anyone in Flora, it's the matriarch. They must well, be after her too then. The king can the king couldn't be trusted. <sighs> Let us go. Straight away. West to the ruins and the and hidden village sour beyond. Watermelon. Okay, so that way for you guys, this way for me. Of course we're followed. I trust you heard that, Victor. Most clearly, Victoria. Then we've little need for the wind vestal to continue living. Hmm. Indeed, though if I may, it seems they make for the vestal of water's side. Yes, and Just kill both. they may serve us better as live baits. We let them go, give chase, and net two vestals at once. Fine, fine. So in the end, it was I who took the festival crown. Unsurprising, but amusing enough. Wouldn't you say, Victor? Just so, Victoria. Wait, you tell me so. she won the pageant? Bro, she's a little creepy, creepy-faced little doll, dude. How did she win the pageant? Okay, what's this blue? Yes, let's go ahead and stay the night. Is this like a side quest for that red guy? The weird creepy man that's trying to tell him all about Just what are these techniques? Bro, don't I worry about it. I on it all night and came up blank. Next time I see that red character, I'm getting a demonstration. One way or another. Don't get a demonstration. You don't want that. It's kind of sus. Okay, let's keep moving on here. Okay, I just slept, so we're good. Okay, so I don't know what I'm doing in that menu. Let's keep moving on. Okay. Oh, blue. Okay, well, I want to finish the blue before we go to the yellow. I'm sorry, are you? That's one of the crystalists. They were certainly in a hurry. Looks like they dropped something. Yeah, that was one of the crystals. We saw Let's them with Olivia. Look. That isn't yours. You oughtn't... No, I oughtn't. And good thing I did. Why? What does it say? Rose to strike Northern Hideaway. Warn them to flee at once. 
What? Rose. The Blood Rose Legion. Let's hurry north. To the hidden village. Indeed. Wasn't it west? Okay, maybe there's two. So wait, is there... Okay, so there's there's another one in here. Where's the other one? Clearly there's nothing here right right now. So we'll have to come back. But now I do... I want to go to that other blue. That other blue before we go to that yellow. So we're going to have to walk all the way around, sadly. But we'll, we'll make it. I really wish I had my ship right now. That's alright. We got some things to fight. Just run. 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 And run. Let's just get out of here. No reason to fight those things. Okay. No reason at all. Okay, so we gotta go all the way up there. To the northern village. Where is this northern village? Oh, I gotta enter there. Okay, let's quickly do a town update, just super, super quickly. Okay, that literally wasn't anything. Okay, well then let's just uh, go ahead and stick our men on there. Okay. Go ahead and give it a quick save. Okay, let's continue into the, into the story mission. Witherwood. Okay. So we get this chest over here first. Remedy. Okay. Don't really need those. Let's see what type of enemies we got here. Oh, we just got more of those thingies. More of the Legion people. Okay. Let's just find you some fires. Oh, we just got a relay. Oh, we just got a relay. Oh, we just got a relay. It's right. It's right here. Oh, he's gonna accident. That's alright, though. Let's see anything over here. Just the chest. One big scorpion. Okay, we'll just attack. That's what we're with him. Bring him out here. Okay. Attack, attack, attack. And then we'll be brave. Arrow, arrow. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Just once more. Don't hurt you, right? This is like a big scorpion. Come on, so cool. Just that one, please. Yeah, let's get into this one right here. I don't think we're nearly strong enough. We're not strong enough at all. There you go, Phil. Five hundred pig. Okay, so we can go through here, but we can also go through the other end also. Oh, maybe not. Sleep blade. Ooh. Flip tis. This is better. It didn't really give me. Oh, it's the exact same. Okay. Well, we'll keep the sleep blade there because it has that added benefit of maybe causing sleep. So definitely gonna keep that one on there. Alright, we're, we're, we'll be good. Nothing there. What about this way? Chest. Phoenix down. Okay. Let's check this way first. But first, an enemy. Okay. We'll keep the same autos going. Alright, yeah, Anya. I like it when she hits all of her hits. Okay, not like that. Okay, fair enough. Okay, a chest. Ooh, okay. If I ever get a ranger, that might be real useful. Let's help 
teleport stone. Okay. Oh, I think a mini dragon. It's out in front of. Oh, that's a bad idea. Okay. Tiz jumped out to protect. Are we dead? Wow, we actually died. Wow. Okay. We actually lost. I didn't actually expect that. Fair enough, I guess. Okay, well anyway, let's keep moving on to where we kind of left off here. Thousand Pig, okay. I like the Pig. Gives me more money to spend. Okay. We just go over here to this next exit. How's our health at the moment? Okay, we're good right now. Got our chest. An ether. Need plenty of those, so definitely not mad about that. Let's grab this chest over here. High potion. Let's also turn the auto off. Just for now. Blue chest. Okay, we can't get those. Again, I think those are for later game. Maybe I should Google how to get those. Maybe I can get them now when I'm just dumb. But I just don't feel like doing it. Maybe I'll Google them right after this episode. Can't go there. Go through here. Okay, so now we get to the point where probably need... Let's make sure everyone's kind of good. It looks like everyone's actually got enough HP, so I shouldn't have to worry about that. Okay, I guess let's just uh, go in. I guess we have nothing to lose, right? If we die, whatever. We just come right back and we try again. Good. It looks like we're in time. Is something wrong? Gather your families and run! This place will soon be attacked! Chill, what? Bruh. No way! Don't have to say it like that. It's the truth. Now hurry! You've got to be kidding me! <laughs> this is no time to be laughing. But it's too funny. How could you fall for it so easily? Where are the fools? What? Hurry, girls! Send word to the Valkyrie. Well. <laughs> We've been skadoodled. To think so simple a snare would work on the infamous Vestal. What's become of the people of this village? You didn't... Gone. And not by my hand. This place was deserted. Though I cannot say whether the original inhabitants left alive or dead. Well, Anya Soblige. Vestal of wind. We killed your sisters, you so will come with me. I'll kill you too. We won't let that happen. I'm here, ya. Yeah. Do not resist. Running is futile as well. You're perfectly surrounded. I'm here, ya. Yeah. You've not been given leave to speak, Adia. A friend of yours. Why are you doing this? This isn't. I've warned you not to speak. I'm afraid I cannot keep silent. Agnes is my friend. <laughs> yes. I've heard all about you, Adia. Traitor to your homeland. Ally to that monster. Alternus begged me to talk sense into you. He was beside himself. He's not. Alternus has nothing to do with this. You and I learned the sword under the same master. We shared a vision. A dream. We swore our blades to the service of Eternia. And pledged to fight for her future. <sighs> Yet here you stand. A traitor. I had to. To free mankind from thraldom before the crystals. To create a new world where all can live in peace. 
These are the tenets of the Grand Marshal's philosophy. But weren't the Crystals the peaceful anyway? When you betrayed your homeland and spat in the face of your father. I just don't get why we weren't living in peace beforehand. I knew nothing before. I was innocent. Ignorant. But no longer. I've seen the world with my own eyes. Judged right from wrong for myself. And now I can say with all confidence, you are wrong. All of you. The Council, the Forces, the Legion. None of you are making people's lives better. You burn cities down. Bleed people dry for money. One atrocity after another. You mean to deny your own father? Just like that? Yes. I don't understand what he's thinking. I can't accept it. What have you been looking at this whole time? The Vestal's illusions? Bro, you literally kill villages. I'll let no one deny it. Not even you. What illusions, dude? You're crazy. This is my final warning. Return to your father's side, Adia. I'm good, brother. I cannot. I won't. I can never go back to the Eternian forces. <sighs> the Grand Marshal's orders were to eliminate any obstacle. Yeah, that's not new. Father! Your words have made this clear. You are an obstacle before me, Adia. And plenty of things have attacked us before, so. Your treason ends now. Nah, I'm good, bro. You feel like going into a permanent coma anytime soon? Alright. Special, hack and slash. Special, piercing bolt. With Agnes, we're gonna go ahead and, um... Use... A wave just in case she defaults and then um, an arrow why not okay she didn't default that literally didn't do anything that's it oh that hurts a lot that hurts a lot might have to like sit here and grind for a what's with her defense why is it so high is it just magic that works against her Okay, magic worked beautifully. Um. Okay, and then I'm just gonna cure everyone. The Dia, I'm just gonna go ahead and um, use a bunch of fires, I guess. Default, and then um, let's use a Kira on everyone. Okay, yeah, let's get everyone a little higher. She crescent moons. Everyone might live. Okay, now everyone will live for sure. I was worried about Ring a Bell for a moment. Okay, I guess it's once again, for the millionth time, it's just the Dia doing damage because everyone else's physical is not strong enough. So Adia will have to carry this entire fight at doing all of that damage. Now let's go ahead and default. Default. Let's default along with everyone else just so we're not caught in a weird place. Default, default. But brave once. And we'll give two curious to everyone. There we go. Okay, make sure everyone stays alive here. Okay, default with Anya's. We're gonna go ahead and use. I guess we can attack her, right? What is it, inner alchemy? Let's use some hidden dragons, I guess. I don't know. I don't really know what else to use. And we can use the piercing bolt as a special and ring a bell. Ouch. Here I come. Okay, this should do like a thousand, hopefully. Okay, solid thousand. And I think after this fight, I'm gonna take Anya's off of Monk. Probably put her on. Valkyrie, maybe. I'm definitely considering it right now. Okay, let's actually do white magic. 
I'm going to go ahead... You know what? Actually, I'm going to default so I can have a few turns here. Okay, I'm just going to default to everyone. Crescent Moon. Okay. Give everyone a nice little cure. Do the same thing. Default, default, default. Keep everyone topped off while getting some moves here. Another cure, default, default, default. Jump. Okay, well... I guess we can't really do anything, so we have to default here. Okay. Damage dispersion! You absolutely love to see it. Okay, ability... Here, everyone. Go ahead and use some Fieras here. Then we're gonna go ahead and, um... Let's do some Hidden Dragons, I guess. Got nothing better to do. And then Brave, Brave, Brave. Might as well use some Arrows here. There you go. It's, hey, 300 damage is 300 damage. So honestly, I'll take that any day. Any day of the week. Yeah, I'm guessing she's lower health, so now she starts actually jumping and stuff, which is fine with me. Get everyone a little cured up here. But I am glad that she jumped on Idea, because that really helps with damage. The damage dispersion is amazing. Probably one of the best things I've put on people so far. Helps a lot. Okay. Not a lot, but it's something, I guess. But yeah, the Valkyrie definitely has high defense. Okay, now we're going to just cure again. And then we're going to use all of the magic again as much as we can. Um, default. I guess let's just use only one arrow this time. Just spirit barrier. What does that do? Does that give her MP? That's really bad. Honestly, I don't mind that we gave her MP. The problem that sucks is we wasted a lot of MP with Adia. A lot. That was 60. And it saved her 4,000 damage. That sucks quite a bit, actually. I didn't expect that. Okay, well then we default, default... Default. Jump. That's fine. Default. Default. Hopefully whoever she jumps on is defaulting. Perfect. Okay, ability. Cure. We're on ourself here. Okay. Does she still have the spirit barrier? She still does. I mean, I don't really know what to do here, right? Because not much I can do. Let's use the... Ooh. Okay, let's do that. Default. I guess let's default again. Crescent Moon. Yeah, the Piercing Bolt should have hit for a good bit. I kind of want to poison her. That would be nice. She's... That... The Piercing Bolt works with that too? What in the world? That really sucks, actually. That sucks a lot. Okay, well, let's just keep everyone healed up for now, I guess. And how am I supposed to beat her? Her physical is so high. Um, when does her... It's gone. Okay, her thing is gone now. That's so annoying. I needed one more turn, apparently. Oh, but I don't even have enough. I can do it three times. That's that's it. One, two. Yeah, I can only do it three times. Then I'm kind of done. Okay. Uh, let's see. I guess we do hidden dragon. I mean, what else are we supposed to do? Okay, and then we'll do some arrows here. Okay, let's go. Ooh. Wow, that killed everyone, almost. 
Okay, well, Tiz luckily is defaulting, so he'll be able to heal people. But that was dangerous. That was actually very dangerous. Okay, she'll use three Furas. Yeah, Agnes is dead, so we'll have to definitely get her back up. I kind of want her to die now, but I also want to get Agnes at XP. Okay, so we're going to Brave. We're going to use an item. Phoenix down on Agnes. And then Cure. Cure, Cure. And then a Piercing Bolt. No holding back. Okay. Will this kill her? Didn't kill her. Okay. Okay, good. I needed Tiz to go before she attacked. Because she was going to probably kill someone. That wouldn't have been good. Honestly, right now, I would like for her to jump. Because that gives me one more turn to heal. Ah, that fire does more than her damage. I might just start doing that. Oh, people are dead here. Okay. Agnes is dead once again. Okay, well, we healed, but Agnes is dead. I love how my monk is using magic. That's the number one sign I need to probably switch it off the monk. Okay, get a cure going. Ooh. Okay, didn't kill anyone though. Didn't kill anyone. Maybe this fear will hopefully do the work. You love to see it. Ooh, we got a Valkyrie thingy. Okay, we got the Valkyrie. What is special about this class? <clears throat> Launches hit and run leaping attacks. Kill the powerful BP attacks. Favors spears. What do they all look like again? What is... Okay. Spears. Okay. Well, it's pr they're pretty defensive too, which is nice. You... Grown stronger. I'm here, yeah. Why do you weep? You've bested me. Be proud. I never wanted. Adia, hear me now. My final request. Meet with him, with your father. Face to face. No more intermediaries. Look at him. Look at him. And you'll see it. What he seeks. I know. I will. I swear it to you. Good. That's good. My sisters. You've come to... Guide me. They're already dead, so they are guiding you. <laughs> it's kind of creepy. You've come to guide me. Did she see him? Uh, quick town update. We just murdered a person, but first, uh, updates. Okay. Oh, that's a lot. Let's get a few going on there. Let's get a few going on here. And then let's get a few going on here. Perfect. Okay. Let's see, where are we going? I think we're just getting out of here then, huh? Oh, I guess we can just continue with the rest of our missions, okay. Alright guys, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna save right here just because. Let's go to items. Let's go to teleport stone. Let's get out of here. Hopefully it takes us to the proper entrance. Indeed it does, perfect. I was scared it was going to take me to the other end for some reason, because 
Um, Final Fantasy 3 did that once, where it took me to the other end, I'm like... Okay, um, okay guys, but I am going to end the episode off here, guys. Uh, next episode, we're going to go and finish that blue, if I can find it. And then also... What are that yellow? So guys, if you did enjoy it, make sure to like a comment as well as my channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.